What's going on guys, I am the Walrus Jedi, and in today's video I will be continuing my Clone Wars coverage with my review of the next three episodes of Clone Wars Season 1, that being Rookies and the two episodes about R2-D2 being lost and all that. So if you like these kinds of videos and want more Clone Wars coverage in the future, then please consider liking and subscribing and hitting the notification bell for Again, more Star Wars videos in the future. There will be spoilers for these episodes of The Clone Wars, so consider that your warning. And now let's get to the cast for the episodes. So you have D. Bradley Baker as the Clone Troopers. James Arnold Taylor as Obi-Wan Kenobi. Matthew Wood as General Grievous and the Battle Droids. Tom Kane as the narrator and Admiral Yularen. Nika Futterman as Asajj Ventress. Matt Lanter as Anakin Skywalker. Ashley Eckstein is Ahsoka Tano, and then Ron Perlman is Ga-Nact. Alright, episode 5, Rookies. Aired October 24th, 2008 on Cartoon Network. It was directed by Justin Ridge and written by Stephen Melching. The moral is, the best confidence builder is experience. After the narration, on the remote moon, Rishi, a clone outpost, is there to help guard Kamino. But when the Separatists send some commando droids to take over the outpost to hide their planned invasion of Kamino, they nearly succeed. A few clone rookies survive the attack, Heavy, Fives, and Echo, and when Cody and Rex arrive for their inspection, the rookies alert Cody and Rex of the droids' perfidy, and they try to take the outpost back. But droid reinforcements prevent this, so they decide to just blow it up. Heavy stays behind when the control for the detonator fails to connect to the explosives, and he manually activates them, alerting the Republic to Grievous's whereabouts, basically saving the day. Fives and Echo get medals and are admitted into the 501st. And that's the end of this particular episode. And I gave that episode a 7 out of 10. Episode 6. Downfall of a Droid, aired November 7th, 2008, on Cartoon Network. Rob Coleman directed it with George Kerstick as writer. The moral, trust in your friends, and they'll have reason to trust in you. After the narration, Anakin Skywalker engages General Grievous at Bothawi. He beats Grievous, but is injured in an explosion. When he awakens, he is in a mid-bay, and he learns that R2 is not there. So he and Ahsoka go to look for R2. They find a Trandoshan scaven ship, and they go in there to look for R2. They find nothing, but that's because R2 is hidden in the ship. R3 is the replacement astromech, and he's sabotaging their attempts. The Trandoshan does have R2, and he's taken him to General Grievous because... General Grievous wants him for all the information that R2 has in his storage as he has never been um, wiped. His memory's never been wiped. And that episode uh, is a 2 out of 10. Episode 7, Duel of the Droids, aired November 14th, 2008 on Cartoon Network. It was directed by Rob Coleman and written by George Kerstick. The moral... You hold on to friends by keeping your heart a little softer than your head. R2 calls for help, which leads Anakin to Grievous's spy base. They go to rescue R2 and to blow up the base. Ahsoka engages Grievous in lightsaber combat and lives. They save R2, blow up the station, and Grievous escapes. I gave that episode a 3.5 out of 10. One lightsaber duel in these batch of episodes. It's Ahsoka versus Grievous. And that's for the, you know, the tally for all the lightsaber duels in the Clone Wars that I'm eventually going to make. What I liked. For Rookies, uh, this is the best of the first seven episodes. And, you know, it's, it's clone-centric, so you learn and they develop the clone characters, which is one of the best aspects of the Clone Wars. Then for Downfall of a Droid, uh, it's cool to see Bothawi. I wish we would go to the planet because that's the home planet of the Bothans, if you didn't know. And it would be cool to see Bothans, as we've never seen them in a TV show or a movie or any of that. So that's a shame. And then for Duel of the Droids, uh, R3 gets destroyed, I guess. 
these two uh, are two lost episodes I'm not a big fan of, if you can't tell. And then for what I didn't like, Rookies, there really isn't anything that I didn't like. Uh, but for Downfall of a Droid, uh, why why, why are these episodes here? They're just not very good. Yeah, and the Trandoshan ship, like, it's just puttering along. Like, it, it doesn't use a hyperdrive. Does it not have a hyperdrive? That doesn't make any sense because it just feels like it's really slow. And then Duel of the Droids, uh, Ahsoka versus Grievous. Like, this is a opportunity that uh, probably should have never been presented because Ahsoka is a Padawan and Grievous can mop the floor with her. As we see in a later episode, Padawans or freshly minted Jedi Knights are cake for General Grievous to kill. So Ahsoka should should have died. So that is a huge knock against that episode well what did you think of these three episodes which is your favorite and you can watch my review of the first four episodes of the clone wars on the top left of the screen now and the review for the clone wars movie bottom left don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed and until next time thank you for watching